So the, uh, you uh, stepped in, obviously, on incredibly short notice after competing. I mean, I wonder what uh, what motivated you to, to be here? Probably the draw, the fact that I didn't get to get a finish. So hopefully this gives me a little bit of redemption to go ahead and uh, go for a finish tomorrow. Um, so, uh, and of course, I didn't come out injured. So, you know, fighters are, it's, you know, if you don't get the decision or, you know, you don't get the turnout, you want that fight, you're right back at it. So this is a perfect opportunity to present itself. There was a lot of controversy, obviously, people upset about the weight miss and that sort of thing. So, I mean, is that part of the motivation, too, to get in here and, I guess, I don't know, give the fans something or prove people wrong or I, I don't know what? You know, I just I just want to th make things right and, and just move forward. Um, obviously, I had a mishap with the weight, which is really tough on me. There was a lot of things behind the scenes that were going on that uh, prevented me from getting there. So, um, I just want to get away from that. I would get, get away from the miss weight, from the draw. And the only way that I can do that is to you know, keep competing. So thankfully, it's like it's a grappling match. I came out healthy, and I feel like obviously I'm in I'm in shape from the fight. And um, yeah, I, I I'm I'm happy that I'm able to just put that behind me and just move forward, starting with quintet. <laughs> we think of you as a contender in MMA, obviously on the rise, but facing a grappling specialist in a grappling match, what kind of special challenges does that make for you? Man, it's it's super cool. I, honestly, I've always I've always wanted to do one of these competitions. I've never got the opportunity to do so. Um, I've always just either had an MMA fight or coming up, or I was injured or something. So um, this was the perfect timing, and I, I love I love grappling. That's like my my main thing thing that I'm the strongest at, and I get to go against Danielle Kelly. She's a super badass grappler, so um, definitely motivates me. It's it's kind of fun just because it's like. It's just like, hey, surprise, good compete. You know, it wasn't something that, uh, you know, obviously when a fight camp, you're there for weeks and weeks, and then you're just like stressing and just training so hard. For this one, it's a little bit less pressure, but it's still a ton of pressure, but in the sense of, I got to make what happened last Saturday right, and this is how I get, get it started. I like it. Danielle, for you, if I could ask, I mean, we're all MMA media, so we know what, like, you know, last second fight changes are like. How about in grappling? I mean, is it is it that big of an impact switching from, from one opponent to another on, on such short notice? Um, kind of not really. I mean, they kind of uh, just with their. I think they have like a both a wrestling background, so not much really changed. Um, unfortunately, my first opponent, Pearl, got uh, injured. Um, I hope she recovers, uh, has a speedy recovery. Um, but I'm just as happy as uh, them giving me a, a new opponent. Um, nothing really changed. I have the same game plan. Uh, I'm just gonna go in there and do my thing. I'm curious if you look at this as an opportunity. Maybe. She has a big name in mixed martial arts, you know, and I'm curious, the, the grappling community, I feel like it doesn't get as much recognition. So do you look at events like this as an opportunity to maybe steal a little bit of that time? <laughs> yeah, I mean, she, you know, she has a lot of followers than, than uh, Pearl, so that was a, you know, that really uh, was a good, uh, you know, a good thing. Um, but other than that, I, it doesn't really matter to me, but it's, it was, it's, a, it's a good feeling. Do, it's you, do you view mixed martial artists as, like, capable of competing on, on a level with you in grappling? Uh, yes, yes. <laughs> <laughs> that didn't it's sound very confident. No. You can talk to trash if you want. It's okay. Um, like, can they compete? In yeah, the maybe on the same level. I mean, because they're because I they're mean, busy focusing on boxing. I mean, it's not an MMA fight, so obviously, like, I would she would beat me in MMA fight. But uh, grappling, like, I'm sure, like, they don't focus on like every detail. So I might be better at like leg locks or. My guard might be better. My top game. I don't know. I'm, I'm a pretty well. I think I'm a pretty well uh, rounded uh, grappler. Um, I can wrestle on my feet. I can full guard. Whatever I feel like it just depends. I mean, I can wrestle with anyone if I want to. Cool. All right. Awesome. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks. Yeah. No. Of course. Thank you.